Mind text that Ernest Holmes wrote, kind of a, an explanation of the philosophy of science of mind. He talks about um, the divine, loving intelligence, the presence that is within us and surrounds us. It's a very moving piece, and he's talking about it, how it is closer than our hands and our feet, and, and what a loving, full presence it is, intelligence. And then he says, he asks in the question about the middle of the paragraph, he says, why then are we afraid, weak, and poor? I thought that's such a great question to ask. If that infinite source is within us and surrounds us, if there's unconditional love and unconditional supply available, then why do we struggle and why do we suffer? You know, I think this is a really great uh, question to ask ourselves after we celebrate um, Easter, you know, the power of the rising up. Well, the question then becomes maybe what blocks that power? What blocks that rising up of love and joy and peace within us? You know, and I will share with you over the years, there have been times in which I specifically have struggled or felt alone or felt like there wasn't enough. And I thought, how come at times that experience of the divine feels so far away or so absent. And, and I would tell you, if you were here with me, I'd have everyone raise their hand who felt that similar experience. And I'll bet a lot of you would. If there is this divine presence within and around us, how come we struggle? 